Next is a conversation with His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on October 14, 1975, in Durban, South Africa. Chanting mantra and herb. But a crooked man cannot be controlled anyway. Therefore, he is more dangerous than the snake. Satpat krutara khala. Why is it that the man cannot be tamed? Because and the that, unintelligent animal can be tamed. Yeah, because man is more intelligent. He can misuse his independence and intelligence. Whereas animal cannot do that. He is not so intelligent. <laughs> he has, that is the defect of the modern civilization. They, they have been described as duskritina. Duskritina means he has got brain more intelligent than the animal. But the brain is being utilized for mischievous activities. Therefore they are called duskritina. Brain should be utilized for some uh, benevolent work for the good of the uh, living entities. But this brain, modern educated brain, is being misused for discovering something which is very dangerous to the human society. That is this. And he is getting Nobel Prize because he has discovered this atomic weapon which is so dangerous and he is glorified. Uh, you have done some nice scientific discovery. What is that discovery? That you can kill the instead of one man with gun, you can kill one thousand men. Therefore, you must be offered noble prize. This is man's appreciation. Better to walk this way to the town. Therefore, they are called murahs, all rascals. How you can understand that this man is mischievously meritorious? How you can understand? Duskitina means mischievously meritorious. This man is meritorious, but he is using his merit for mischievous activities. That is called Duskitina. So how you can understand this man is mischievously meritorious? You can say, how is that? The man is meritorious and at the same time is mischievous. There are so many organizations, especially in Western countries, big, big rogues organizations, simply for cheating, simply for smuggling. They have got merit. Otherwise, how they have organized such big, big organization? But what for? Our mischievous. Harassing government, harassing people, the merit is no merit. There are many organizations in the Western country. Is it not? Yes, it's true. Yes. Many, many. All these Reality business. Reality business, you know? Realty. Ah. Yeah. Ah. Seventy-five percent of them are mischievous. I have got experience. Yes. Seventy-five percent. They are simply mischievously planning. You have got five thousand, ten thousand dollars to take it away 
showing you that we are getting uh, two hundred thousand worth of property in this way. They make implication. Take your ten thousand dollar and then finish. Many cases. Their only business is this. Big big lawyer implicated. That was a dushkiti. Go to your lawyer immediately. You are implicated. You see, this man is condemned, Nixon, and he is to pay the lawyer's bill by working hard by writing a book and selling the, uh, um, the goodwill to some company. He has to pay the lawyer's bill. He has no money. The lawyers, doctors, as soon as they get some opportunity, immediately capture it and finish. How to take away all your money? Because artificially they have uh, enhanced the standard of living, they want money. So unless they do mischievous activity by honest means, they cannot get money. That's described in the Bhagavad Gita. Huh? Bhagavad Gita that they earn money by by illegal methods. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Why is it that in the modern day, good people, they don't come into public office? Hmm? Good people. Yeah. In previous ages, the, the, uh, they were Rajarishis, great kings, very pious kings. Why is it that Be only rogues are aspiring the, today? Because the democracy, you will not get both. As soon as you become honest man in the public office, nobody will be obedient to you. And it will be impossible for him to execute any. You see? The bank manager in Delhi, he was my friend, that uh, I'm afraid of this union. If I press them to do something, they will immediately touch that with the whole management. The bank manager. So I'm afraid of the uh, workers' union. Good men, they do not go to this political force because they know they will not be able to do anything good. He will be surrounded by all rogues. Nobody will execute his order. So the future in Kali Yuga looks very bleak. Very, very bleak. Achinna dar dravina gachanti grikanana. People, general people, will be so much disgusted that they will be obliged to give up family and home and go to the forest. Being disappointed. Now I cannot manage. Let me buy it. That's predestined. Huh? That's predestined. Yes, predestined. But that can all change in a minute. Yes, that can be changed only by Therefore, we are go Girikanana, but take a shelter of Krishna. Banangatu jad harima asraya. Go, leave your this so, so far, family, home, and go to the forest and take shelter of Krishna. That is advised by Pallarma. That is the best thing in life. If you want to be free from anxiety, give up this so-called family life, go to the forest 
and take shelter of Lord Krishna. That is Pallad Maharaj's advice. Don't try to adjust it. It is not possible. Especially in Kali Yuga. Especially in Kali Yuga. So we are offering them shelter that in this age you are not accustomed to go to the forest. It will be more inconvenient. Come to our center and be Krishna conscious and chant Hare Krishna, your problem should be solved. This is our mission. Everyone is faced with problems, otherwise why there is majority of suicide? Everyone is faced with problem. It's best to go this way. No, they're, they're playing golf. Oh. How persistent life is. His main body is cut into pieces, but still he is struggling to exist. Hmm. He has got some attachment. I shall leave here, stand here for 10,000 years. This is my David J. Sarvino. Can a, a man's intelligence be rectified? Hmm? If intelligence is the... This is the Hari Kirtan. Chant. Somehow or other induce them to chant Hare Krishna. Everything all right. By flattering, by uh, soliciting, by giving him prasad, by elevating him that you are the best man in the world. In this way, inducing him, please chant Hare Krishna. Then he will be. This is Hare Krishna moment. There is no other way. He is wind. And the more the college advances, he becomes more and more wind. All other attempts will fail you. Don't you see in your country the LSD addicted uh, hippies? The government spent so much money to rectify them, failure. But as soon as they come to our camp, immediately success. How this way? By this chanting, that of the is the amazement. That is the amazement of Professor Judah and all others. How it is happening? There is something in the Hare Krishna moment. This is good propaganda with the governments also. Mm -hmm. This is good way to get the governments to support our movement more and more. The it? government is never object to it. No. Never. I never met any objection from government side. Mm. <clears throat> Neither even Christian priestly side. I never met any of them. They understand that he is doing something. 
Srila Prabhupada, it always seems that there's some kind of inspiration for spiritual life there. Is that simply mental concoction or is it actually a fact, the land itself? Land. It is the influence of the land. Just like Vrindavan, whatever you may be, you stay there, you become spiritual. Simply you stay there. possible to reform a person even against their will? Hmm? Is it possible to reform a person against their will? No. Not possible. Sign through the problem that someone is actually having change in heart. Hmm? What is the sign that someone is actually having change in heart? By his action? who tried to make Prahlad atheist, he failed. And Prahlad tried to make his father atheist, he failed. Don't you see? Yes. So unless one agrees, he cannot turn. He is not possible. Hmm? Five years old boy stands the body, and the powerful Hiranakasu father who is threatening with his life in so many ways, he tries that you become a thist, godless. Otherwise I shall kill you. He has did not agree. And similarly, the son also solicited the father that you have got so much power by the grace of God, why you are becoming a thist? Both of them could not turn to their side. Prahlad remained Prahlad, and he remained Prahlad. Hmm? Yes. Yes. can expect that without agreeing, conceding, one can be reformed. No, that is impossible. Not simply by rubber stamp. No, that is not. You must agree. Yes, therefore Guru is equal. Guru means, accept Guru means whatever you say, I will accept. That is Guru. Otherwise, friendly talk. Friendly talk will not do. To accept Guru means, now I accept you, Guru, my instructor, without any argument. And there is exception. Whatever you say, I shall do. That is agreement. Then he can be reformed. Sushasteham sadhima prapannam. I surrender unto you, I become your disciple, now you train me. Then can be reformed. Other is not. When, we, when we're at school, we accept the teacher and he teaches us mathematics or something like this. But when it comes to spiritual life, when we accept a guru, um, people are criticized by saying, um, oh, you're, you're not thinking for yourself anymore. Um, you're not... You're yes, not, you're becoming we have surrendered. You say, yes, we have surrendered. That is the way. The first book. Um, term is surrender, panipat. Otherwise, it is not possible. He, he, one does not surrender. It is no, there is no question of reformation. He must voluntarily surrender. Yes, whatever you say, I shall do. Then things can be 